Uh, hi, uh, this is Veronica Burian. Uh, she's originally from Prague but lives in Barcelona mm -hmm. now and she's the co-founder of Type Together. Hi there, this is Jose Scalione, my partner at Type Together. He lives in uh, Argentina, originally graphic designer and now, like me, type designer. The building bridges, very Definitely. Building bridges in a met metaphorical sense, building communities, therefore. But yeah. building real bridges is also <laughs> very important. Although you can't really build a bridge, let's say, I don't know, between Armenia and England. I think <laughs> hard a bit. Well, <laughs> in any case, <laughs> um, I think um, linking things together, things that are separated, and bringing them together in, in any kind of way is always uh, helpful. Someone will have half an idea and the other part will have another half. And um, bridging them um, is, is certainly something that we want to do. It's certainly a challenge uh, in those aspects, like you said technical and also to research <clears throat> scripts that you are not familiar with, you have no um, real intuitive understanding. So yes, there, there's a lot of um, resources that go into it if you want to do it well. I mean, you can do it really badly and just not give a damn, but uh, if you want to do it well and, and with some foundation, which actually then makes it <clears throat> work workable for people uh, who use that script then yeah it's it's a it's a challenge on many levels but uh it's uh, it's super important i think and a lot of fun and yeah a lot of fun no i don't think um technical developments are really up to date they, there is a lot to be done, um, both in the sense of uh, uh, type ses typesetting systems and, and in typography making systems. Um, we think there is, I mean, there is certainly a limitation in tools, there is a limitation in methods, and there is a mm. limitation in processes, and that is not addressed uh, in a very clever manner by any software right now. So no, I mean the. There are developments in that direction, recognizing that kind of need, yes. but it's, it's still it's pretty, pretty yeah. difficult. Yeah, also because the, the scripts, the different scripts have different demands. Yeah, it's uh, and sure there is some kind of focus on on, on, on Latin, because that's where still the, um, the main kind of market or it's, it's economically viable. Yes. Yeah. The, the non-Latin markets are, are ill-served yeah. or badly served, and so... So there's certainly a need. Right. Um, if it ends up commercially viable, I think it's a long-term view Yeah, you have to take. You, you can't really expect, um, at least in a retail market, something <clears throat> like this to happen, to take off within just a few months. It, it's more of a longer term. Ooh. Yeah, it well, would be nice yeah, um, to to take away the, the, the Latin, non, yeah, the, the, the non. kind of Latin focus. <laughs> uh, of global scripts, probably, or I think having script in in it as a, certainly a writing system is just a bit long. Mm. Yeah, so don't don't have a catchy catchy name. No, sorry. <laughs> we will think about it.